Pitbull attack in Oklahoma County. Happened this morning when a woman was ambushed by a pack of dogs on her own property. Yet, as Kirsten McIntyre discovered, some claim this isn't an isolated incident, Kirsten. Well, Kelly, some neighbors are pretty angry about the problem. They say they've complained multiple times and have gotten no help. They believe this morning's attack could have been prevented. Both forearms and legs, and then a few of them have just, I've, I've got five puncture wounds. They had, little, they had to put one or two little stitches in. The bandages are fresh. The memory of what happened still raw. I was scared. I was afraid. It was about 8 o'clock this morning when Mary noticed a pack of neighborhood pit bulls in her yard. She'd seen them before and went out to pet them. Actually, when they bit me hard and I began to kind of defend myself is when then it, it just kicked off a whole <laughs> feeding frenzy. Mary managed to get to her Jeep, but getting the door shut was another challenge. Finally, I just sort of wedged their, wedged their heads in, in between the door, and then eventually then they sort of pulled their heads out, and I was able to, to shut the door. The dog surrounded her vehicle and continued to jump on it. Mary honked her horn and screamed for help. Finally, a neighbor heard her and called 911. She's trapped inside of her car. Apparently, the dogs have attacked her. She's in total hysterics. Mary asked us not to show her face, saying she's concerned about causing problems among her neighbors. It's been an ordeal with these dogs. But Bill Newton isn't too worried about that. He says he's complained to the county several times, but nothing's been done. He says the dogs have killed several of his pets and came after he and his daughter. And they just took off running at us. So I grabbed her. I tried to put her up in a tree. And... Uh, I thought they're going to overtake us. Any dog, they have a tendency to, to have a kind of a pack mentality, and I think that's probably what, what took place. Now, the dog's owner did not want to go on camera. We should mention at least one of the dogs recently got out of quarantine after an attack involving a neighborhood child.